So Rapati, uh, tell us a little bit about yourself and uh, what school you got into. Okay, hi, um, I'm from Notre Dame High School and I joined Share World under Dr. Yoshida and I'm going to Caltech, Caltech. next year. What do you want to uh, study at Caltech? I'll be double majoring in computer science and I haven't decided the second major, it's between economics and aerospace. Oh, wow, okay. So um, what, how did you come to uh, choose these two majors? Well, computer science was always what I wanted to do. Um, since the freshman year, I did robotics for years and years. So that was something that I was definitely going to major in. But economics, um, I think, recently happened within this last year when I got involved in the finance aspect of my robotics team. And then aerospace, just because Caltech is so well known for aerospace. So I wanted to um, profit off of that and make use of that. Okay. So then um, uh, I see that your are uh, you're, um... Your counselor was Dr. Yoshida. So mm -hmm. how did um how did you feel that Dr. Yoshida helped you uh, build like a profile um to help you uh, get into the schools that you wanted to? Yeah, so especially Caltech, I don't think I would have gotten into Caltech without Dr. Yoshida. She um really drove home the point that Caltech especially really just wants to see STEM from an applicant. There's no like you should include um some well-roundedness like poetry or anything like that. She was very clear that Caltech wants to see that you are a well um, focused STEM person that you're good at many aspects of STEM. So I made sure that all my essays revolved around that. And I like I showed in my activities section that most of them were STEM activities. And I put in just a couple of humanities ones to show that I was well-rounded, but definitely Dr. Yoshida's advice about making sure that you show that you are capable as a STEM student was probably what got me into Caltech. Wow. Is there anything you would like to uh, share your, or like uh, say to your counselor? Um, thank you so much it was basically the um, general message. I don't think I would have gotten this far without you. And I really appreciate all your support and the late nights that you spent <laughs> editing my application at like two in the morning. So I'm very grateful. Thank you. Congratulations. Awesome. <laughs> Dr. Yoshida, do you want to uh, tell us a little bit, um, like a little bit about uh, Rapati from your perspective? Rapati is obviously very smart, but she's a very, very creative person at the same time. So her essays are full of creative ideas and it just needed to be catered to each different colleges. And of course, Caltech, STEM oriented, but that doesn't mean that, you know, you can only talk about STEMs. Keep in mind, everybody who's going to apply, home application does have additional information section. You can include anything you want in there. If you want to focus a little bit on your creative side, while your essays are mainly catering to STEM, you can use that part as well. So for Rupali, for each college, we made small adjustment for how we are going to use each section of the application. And I'm glad that it worked out for her. Congratulations. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you so much, Rupali.